hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you which is better google sheets or microsoft excel let's begin google sheets is a web-based spreadsheet application developed by google it is part of the google workspace of productivity tools and it's free to use with a google account all right so here in google sheets it will allow you to create edit and collaborate on spreadsheets in real time now for you to be able to try the google sheets online all you have to do is hover to the upper right corner where you can choose the small business or for enterprise but before that you might want to check the pricing if you're interested to know that the google workspace account which offers all of the google ecosystem workspaces including the google sheets is around five dollars point 40 for a business starter for the business standard it's going to be ten dollars point 80 the business plus is 18 dollars per month and the enterprise is something that is you might want to contact sales and book a demo or a sales call now let's click the start a trial where it all we have to do is just follow the on-screen instructions now one of the key features of google sheets is the collaboration because multiple users can work on the same spreadsheet simultaneously and in terms of the templates right here you can choose from any of the following limited templates that you can use to create your first spreadsheet is it going to be a blank spreadsheet a purchase order schedule monthly budget to do list annual budget and travel planner for example we're going to be using the travel planner for now if you do that you would be forwarded to the template and these are going to be highly customizable all of it from the title right here you can put in here you also have the option to insert a photo if you want all right click on image over sales wait for it to load okay so you have that photo uploaded already from here you see since it's cloud-based it is accessible from any device with an internet connection and files are also stored securely in the google drive now you see you can do multiple options here you can put in a for a for data format formula and a lot more right in terms of the collaboration you see you can go to the share button you have the capability to restrict anyone so that no one can access this uh, project of your google sheets or anyone with the link can get and uh, access to this one click on done and that's good apart from that you see there is an option here for the joining a meeting while using the google sheets because again it is part of the google ecosystem you can start a meeting and use a meeting code while presenting this spreadsheet that you have created on the file option you have the uh choices to share with others publish to web attach this file as an email attachment download as a microsoft excel which we were going to discuss in a bit you have the option to download as an open document a pdf a web page a csv and a tab separated values they also have an option to see the version history so who edited the last version of this file especially helpful if you're working with multiple freelancers all right in terms of data you can create a filter you can sort sheet you can format you can change the theme if you wanted all right you can customize and do a lot of things here in google sheets all right now the app, when we go to our next contender which is microsoft excel now it is a powerful spreadsheet software developed by Microsoft. It is widely popular, which is used for data organization, analysis, and visualization. Microsoft Excel is part of the Microsoft suite and is available for both a desktop and cloud platforms via the Microsoft 365. And from here, all we have to do is check the pricing. You see, for businesses, Microsoft 365 Basic is around $6 per month. The business standard is 12.50. The Microsoft 365 Business Premium is $22. And the 360 apps 
for business is 8.25. For home, you get these, all right? 19.89 with a yearly plan. And the uh, personal is 69.99 per year. And you have all these perks and benefits. If you sign up for an, uh, a free account, you would be forwarded here to start your one-month trial or buy the Microsoft 365 wherein you can sign up for free and cancel anytime. Once you have successfully created your account here in Microsoft Excel, one of the key features is going to be in terms of data management. You can organize data in rows and columns within the worksheet. You can use a template right here, simple list, evergreen calendar, simple service invoice, project tracker, premium templates. Or you can start from a blank workbook. To do that, you have the option to rename the book here. All right, type it in. Now you can rename this file. You can put in a pictures, forms, and a lot more from this device. It supports multiple worksheets in a single workbook. Now. You can put in formulas and functions right here. They have 450 built-in functions for calculations, logical operations, and data manipulations. All right. In terms of the data visualizations, you can create chart right here. For example, if you want to create chart, you have the data, formulas, page layout, view, and a lot more. All right. You also have the option to insert shapes right here. Maybe this. And there's a lot that you can work with in terms of the integration. On the upper right corner, you see there's going to be an option that says a share. If you want to share this a specific Excel file that you're working, you might want to click on that option. You can add the name, put in the message right here, copy link and send it to your maybe your freelance maybe to your client, your boss, or if you're working with multiple freelancers. All right, so. Now, you have an option for the editing or viewing. For example, if you don't want any part of your team member to edit this accidentally, you might want to limit their access. You also have the option to open the Microsoft Excel on the desktop application. It's very simple. Now, the question remains, which one is for you? We highly suggest that you choose Microsoft Excel if you need powerful data analysis, advanced features, or work with large data sets. Now, if you are already using the Microsoft Office ecosystem, the Microsoft Office 365, you have an access to Outlook, OneDrive, ClipChamp, Forms, OneNote, Skype, Teams, and a lot more, Microsoft Excel is the better choice for you. On the other hand, you might want to choose Google Sheets if you value real-time collaboration, accessibility, and cost-effectiveness, and of course, if you are a big user of the Google ecosystem. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next one.